Engineer 775, just staring at a fire. It's one thing I like to do, it's relaxing. <laughs> um, we have just installed this Pacific Energy stove. Um, I added some new DuraVent um, double liner, chimney liner here with a stove adapter, so everything's good there. And uh, it's a great, great little stove. Got the coils, everything's hooked up. And we are thermal siphoning. I am, uh, it's slow, but the, the goal of this project is to heat a tank of water. I'm trying to get my heat gun out here. Let's see if I can show some temperatures. It's not. Let's see what we're getting. Not tremendous, about 83 on the top of the coil and uh, 75 so oh been running 10 degrees difference there was about 7 degrees difference and so we are getting a, a differential in temperature let me take you to the tank pretty much uh, redid all, all the fittings in copper you got the pecs off of there it was kind of ugly so we are uh, leak free and uh, let's see if this thing is working. We've got 60 degrees at the bottom of this tank, kind of right where the fitting goes in, right around 60, 59 degrees. And then at the top where the water's going in, we've got, we've got 70. So we've got a 10 degree temperature differential here so it's thermal siphoning but real slow but that's okay so all right uh, I think I'm just gonna leave everything unwrapped for now make sure this baby doesn't have any leaks doesn't seem to now this little automatic vent is just sweet bell and gosset automatic vent here you basically turn it to its tight and back it off uh, Full turn and it's venting, just awesome. Let's air out, no water out though. And I guess that's it. So, this is uh, not only a thermal siphon tank, but like I said, the hot water's coming out of the top and I've got it running into the cold side of the electric water heater. So, even in the summer, this tank will be effective for warm showers without any temperature, without any source of energy. Yes, because we're right next to the roof. Somebody mentioned putting a solar panel. That would definitely be an option of heating the water with solar. Um, but for now, it's wood and uh, convection. <laughs> so, all right. So, that's pretty much it. None of the pipes are, are hit. One of the things I've worried about is uh, just the, the distance. Um, I guess if I was to do it differently, I would run a, a chase straight up the wall wouldn't look as pretty but it would be a straighter run and uh, might thermal siphon a little better so okay thanks for watching and uh, appreciate any comments you have this is uh, a new project uh, trying to um, heat water without um, a pump and um, we could we could add a th um, circulating pump in and if I was to do it I'd probably do it right here I've got an outlet here put a temperature probe down on the coil and it would heat the water a little faster but uh, this is didn't want to do it that way that's worst case scenario I could put a circulating pump on it okay engineer 775 signing off thanks for watching